I asked her why she was crying. She said, I was bullied because of my body. Do you know why she can't get the bullying, guys? She got bullied because she was fat. She has a big body. The question that, what's wrong being a fat girl? Well, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. The case happened to my friend showed that almost the woman had been bullied because of her body, right? Hey, I just want to ask you, girl. What do you think of pretty? Is it like Miss Jennifer Contestant? Or Victoria's Secret Models? Is it thin or slim? Today, we are bombarded by the construction of beautiful women as white skin, slim, and sexy. As a consequence, the research also found that 80% of women said that the image of women in advertisement, movies, and television makes them feel insecure. What is the result? If you are not slim, you are not pretty. Ask her, I don't neglect that appearance is everything for us. In every condition, we have to look at the mirror or with skills to know whether we look pretty or slim. Why is it matter, ladies and gentlemen? Being slim will benefit you in the future. Have you ever known the blobby and fluffy stewardess or models? I bet. They all in the same type, slim and sexy. Then we are forced to be like them. Then we are forced to be slim by our surrounding. But how if we cannot fulfill the expectation of society? We cannot be slim, for example. The case of my friend taught you everything. She is called Gajah because she was fat. When there is an all you can eat party or prasmanan, my bullet friend was always being the center of attention. Why? Because everyone will advise her not to eat much. Hey, just don't eat all. Give others food, fatty. Yes, they all bullet her. They give belt what to her. That's how bullying simply happen in our life. We just easily say something rude to others. And the word, we may not realize that what we have said will change others' life drastically. What's the impact, ladies and gentlemen? Lots of young women wanted to have a slimmer body. They don't want to be caught as fatty again. Then, they do diet. From mayo diet, keto diet, OECD diet, and other tartaring diet. They avoid rice, chocolate, ice cream, and other fat and carbohydrate-based food. They consume diet medicine and cathartic. They do extreme exercising for hours. But how if the diet is built? Malnutrition haunted them because they like the proper nutrient. Body dysmorphic disorder manifested in anorexia and bulimia makes them upset with the slim body. To the worst, they think that they cannot be slim. And yes, they will come in suicide. Lots of young women do this because simply, they don't appreciate their life. You see? How your word can ruin others' life. How just simply saying fatty will harm them. I don't want bullying spread and happen in our surrounding. So I will give you several ways to stop the bullying. First, we should be kind to others. It means that we need to have more attention to them. 
For example, if your friend to the bullying, try to prohibit or separate them. You also can give motivation or spirit to the person who get bullied by others. By doing this, you have already shown that you are the one who can. You also be the one who can decide. Second, we should understand that we need to not easily mocking others. Your words are your weapon. We should appreciate others, whatever condition. Try to be considerate to others. Don't look others based on the appearance. The last, love yourself more than the sexy body. You need to acknowledge that you are created differently. Realize that you are just human being, not the Barbie doll. As long as you are healthy physically and mentally. It's okay not to be slim and sexy. You work more than your body. That's all my speech, ladies and gentlemen. I hope you can get the point of my speech. One thing you have to remind, that beautiful is all about attitude and manner, not about your sexy body.